In this tutorial, we're going to look at the border subobject of the Edit Poly geometry type in 3ds Max. So I'll go ahead and start by creating a plane. Go to our modifier list, add an Edit Poly modifier, open that up, and select border. So border refers to any uh, outline of a shape or a form, and then also any opening. So let's say I have a few holes in this form. Border will um, correspond to the openings and also the outline edge. So there's a few things you can do to borders that are similar to edges and uh, vertices. So for example, I could select these four inner borders and then extrude those. Um, just like edges and vertices, you can change the base extrusion amount as well. Um, you can also insert, uh, inset, insert vertices or chamfer. You can also cap. So cap just adds a polygon and kind of closes the border. So now those will no longer be borders because they're not openings. So if I just control Z and undo that, um, that's the cap. You can also bridge borders. So if you have, let's say you have this border, I'm just going to kind of move this one up and then rotate it at an angle. And then I'll move this one up over here as well. And then rotate that at an angle. I want these basically to kind of face each other. So if I want to create a bridge between these two openings, I could select both those borders and then hit bridge here and it'll create a, a polygon, polygonal bridge um, between those two geometries. So you can actually change the number of segments. You can also um, kind of bulge or squeeze the bridge or you can um, kind of bias how it's affecting that or you can even twist it. So if I want it to be a twisted bridge, you could twist it um, depending on what you're looking for. And then when you're happy with it, you can check that box. Um, you can also connect, so uh, similar to the edit edges, and then you can also create shapes. So just like um, the edit edges, if I want to create that outline as an editable spline, you can create shape uh, of that border.